The investigation by Citadel security turned up no evidence to support your charge of treason. An eyewitness saw him kill Nihilus in cold blood. We've read the Eden Prime reports, Ambassador. The testimony of one traumatized dock worker is hardly compelling proof. I resent these accusations. Nihilus was a fellow Spectre and a friend. Uh-oh. What happened? You always seem to be involved when humanity makes false charges against me. And this must be your protege, Commander Shepard. The one who let the beacon get destroyed. Uh, I want to say sorry about that, but apparently the virus that Apple is has decided that I need to update a bunch of fucking shit. So, sorry about that. The mission to Eden Prime was top secret. The only way you could know about the beacon was if you were there. With Nihilus gone, his files passed on to me. I read the Eden Prime report. I was unimpressed. But what can you expect from a human? Saren despises humanity. That's why he attacked Eden Prime. Your species needs to learn its place, Shepard. You're not ready to join the Council. You're not even ready to join the Spectres. He has no right to say that! That's not his decision! Shepard's admission into the Spectres is not the purpose of this meeting. This meeting has no purpose. The humans are wasting your time, Counselor. And mine. Uh, arrogant, yes, arrogant bastard. You can't hide behind the council forever. There is still one outstanding issue. Commander Shepard's vision. It may have been triggered by the beacon. Are we allowing dreams into evidence now? How can I defend my innocence against this kind of testimony? I agree. Our judgment must be based on facts and evidence, not wild imaginings and reckless speculation. Do you have anything else to add, Commander Shepard? Yes, what's the point? You've made your decision. I won't waste my breath. The Council has found no evidence of any connection between Saren and the Geth. Ambassador, your petition to have him disbarred from the Spectres is denied. I'm glad to see justice was served. This meeting is adjourned. It was a mistake bringing you into that hearing, Captain. You and Saren have too much history. It made the Council question our motives. I know Saren. He's working with the Geth for one reason. To exterminate the entire human race. Every colony we have is at risk. Every world we control is in danger. Even Earth isn't safe. We need to deal with Saren ourselves. As a Spectre, he's virtually untouchable. We need to find some way to expose him. What about Garrus, that CSEC investigator? We saw him arguing with the executor. That's right. He was asking for more time to finish his report. Seems like he was close to finding something on Saren. No. Any idea where we could find him? I have a contact in CSEC who can help us track Garrus down. His name is Harkin. Forget it. They suspended Harkin last month, drinking on the job. I won't waste my time with that loser. You won't have to. I don't want the Council using your past history with Saren as an excuse to ignore anything we turn up. Shepard will handle this. Uh, Captain, yeah. You can't just cut Captain Anderson out of this investigation. The Ambassador's right. I need to step aside. I need to take care of some business. Captain, meet me in my office later. Harkin's probably getting drunk at Cora's Den. It's a dingy little club in the lower section of the wards. Maybe there's another way to find evidence against Saren. You should talk to Barla Vaughn over in the financial district. Rumor has it he's an agent for the Shadow Broker. The Shadow Broker? An information dealer. Buys and sells secrets to the highest bidder. I've heard Barla Vaughn's one of the top representatives. He might know something about Saren. But his information won't come cheap. You and Saren have a history. What happened? About 20 years ago. I was part of a mission in the Skillian Verge. I was working with Saren to find and remove a known terrorist threat. Saren eliminated his target, but a lot of people died along the way, innocent people. And the official records just covered it all up. But I saw how he operates. No conscience, no hesitation. 
He'd kill a thousand innocent civilians to end a war without a second thought. Uh... He's a monster! Now, let's see what else is going on here. Uh, you know what? Fuck it. We're just gonna leave. I should go. Good luck, Shepard. I'll be over in the ambassador's office if you need anything else. Cool. Alright, we've, we've learned things and we've had a very long conversation that went nowhere, so... Time to leave, I guess. What is this? Ch Corbin, Chorbin, whatever the fuck is. Up to something. What guy? The one over by the keeper. This one? What? Oh, no, I wasn't. Never mind. What? Um, yes, is there something you want? Why are you so interested in the keepers? Keepers? I've got no interest in the keep. Don't get coy. I know what I saw. I, uh... I'm not so sure I should be talking to you about this. Just tell me what you're doing. I'm not here to get you into trouble. All right. I guess it wouldn't hurt to tell you. I'm using a small scanner to gather readings on the keepers. So far I've had mixed results. I find it difficult to get near the creatures. Why were you being so secretive about it, though? Well... Technically, we're not supposed to disturb the Keepers. I don't really think my scanning disturbs them, but the authorities might disagree. I'd like to do it more openly, but it's not really worth getting arrested over. I could help you out. I'm not worried about the authorities. I don't even know who you are. I'm Commander Shepard, with the Alliance Military. Hmm. Well, I, I suppose I could use the help. You'll need this. It's the scanning device I developed. Activate it each time you see a Keeper. All collected data will automatically upload to my database. I'll even send a few credits your way for each unique scan. What are you doing with the data once you've scanned it? Trying to learn whatever I can about the Keepers. We see them working everywhere, yet we know so little about them. I'm a scientist. I want to know what makes them tick. I should get going then. Yes, I have much work myself. So long, and good luck with the scanning. Okay, now, I, I've i scanned and got money and XP for it. Well, isn't that, isn't that lovely? It's a, it's, a, it's like 30 Wing Wangs out of it, so I'll, I'll take it. I got money. I do want to check out these little areas, though, just in case somebody's uh, holding out on me over here with an upgrade part or something. Also, where'd the music go? Alright, thank you. Thank you for coming back. Whew. Man, that was a that was just a, a bad meeting with the with the council. Uh, also, I am kind of pissed that Apple said some shit. No, I'm waiting to speak Hello. To one of the counselor's assistants. Commander. All right. Hello, Rear Admiral. Commander. <laughs> Rear Admiral. <laughs> oh, look! I found another one. Here you go. Another scan. More XP. More money. I'll take it. I'm definitely fine with that. No, I just want to ask a couple of questions. Am I, am I supposed to sit here and listen to that? Because I don't really want to. That doesn't seem like my uh, cup of tea. Because I really don't want to sit here and do nothing. And that's what I've done. My uh, my past week has been kind of rough. Um, Monday, I had three finals, and I took all three of my finals, begrudgingly, but that meant that I was done with final tests, uh, but I still had a shit ton of lab work to do for my welding lab, so I went and did all that. I probably should have taken the rapid transit system, but I'm here. Who cares? I got where I need to go. Uh, yeah, whatever, I, oh, there we go. Look at that. Two Presidium. Alright, well. I like the elevator music. It's nice. I can't really talk to them either. I can't believe the council ignored all the evidence against Saren. Saren's one of their best operatives. It's only natural they take his word over ours. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.